abruptly disconnected because it started abruptly and suddenly it also got abruptly disconnected so that's the reason i just thought i will whatever i started i wanted to complete so the reason why i am doing this today is because uh, too much of work suddenly you get bored and doing the same thing again and again and again so that's the reason right now i'm uh, doing the same thing so uh, are you someone uh, who's also getting bored like me in the home if you are bored like that jump in into this call and if you guys have any questions doubts you can ask me and i can answer some questions which i know otherwise it's okay so i'm trying to see other technology which will work here so i hope this technology is going to work mm no idea just checking okay hold on just a minute hold on looks like i am actually going live right now am i right now going live yeah right now i'm going live yes go ahead and uh, you know the previous one uh, went disconnected and that's the reason i am talking to you in this live and uh, if you guys have any questions doubts go ahead and ask me because i am bored i can answer any questions that you have and one big question i have right now is uh, what to do in this uh, next laptop so this is how the whole thing is going to happen what am i supposed to do now okay what are you supposed to do now is this the way the whole world is going to be looks like that only okay looks like that the whole world will be never be the same like how it was so let's hope for it and uh, whenever uh, you know uh, I, i think life will never be the same like before is one song i always loved and uh, i think it's going to happen the same way will you after the covid the whole world is never going to be the same the way in which you're going to carry our work the way in which you're going to carry our business the way in which our we are going to carry our relationships social life health everything is going to change that's what for sure okay so i hope uh, everyone understands the seriousness of the situation and bring some transformation in their life and if you guys have anything else to share you can comment below how exactly you are going to deal with uncertainty right now or how exactly uh, you know uh, do you think that the whole world will span around do you have any idea what's your perspective do you think the whole situation will change how do you think the whole humanity will treat this how do you think that you as a person okay uh, has understood this situation and uh, what are the changes that are going to bring in your life just go ahead and comment and if you uh, maybe we can come up with some interesting discussions probably i will have a separate live on this particular topic on how the whole situation will will open up we don't know uh, it, the whole thing looks like it will change in a multiple way probably the businesses will change the way in which our relationship with other people is going to change the way in which we are going to do take care of our health will change you know we have to uh, i think the whole world is going through sunil i think sunil you asked me you are asking me this question what we have to practice to overcome this from stage eh? from stage fear <laughs> wow <laughs> you change the whole topic oh uh, yeah yeah this is the easiest thing sunil what i am doing right now the easier way to get rid of stage fear is open the camera and start talking <laughs> okay we will have new normal absolutely sheshatri yes we will be having a new normal so the old normal is gone and it's going to be a new normal in the world absolutely true that's true and uh, you know uh, everyone has their own uh, challenges uh, and then here is someone who's vikash wow you how to effectively use your current time to talk about business owners thank you for that link to vikash for sharing that thank you very much for that and you know everyone's routine will change everyone's lifestyle is going to change it's not that something uh, uh, you can actually do it why because why am i sharing with you is as i think madhusudan has posted it beautifully one who is adaptable to the change is the person who is going to actually succeed right now so the virus has the ability to adapt and change if the virus can change remember it's a small microorganism and so is human beings we also can actually change a lot okay so uh, we have to find our own ways find our own means to handle this uncertainty but the world will always be different i can i can i think the i think many businesses will change i believe many people will change the way in which they're going to work i think work from home will become some norm of many people i believe or probably i don't know probably 10 years from now people will not even go to offices and work also i don't know okay uh, so vikash thank you very much for that it is this the time you can reinvent ourselves absolutely true vikash this is the best time to reinvent ourselves also because this is an opportunity uh, god given opportunity i will say okay god in the form of a virus given us an opportunity to 
pause and reflect our own self what we can do what we are doing whether it's working or not everything okay so that's a good thought because that it's time for us to reinvent your ourselves so here is a question to you guys what is that one thing you have reinvented within you okay have you reinvented you uh, reinvented within you something some kind of a self reflection you found and because of that uh, you got some amazing eureka moment go ahead and share it below and jay nayar says that digital will take upward trends my perception towards startups will change more helpful oh jay i really really like your perspective absolutely true the whole i think a lot of new companies are going to pop up huh? i'm telling the way in which the whole thing is happening there are a lot of people going to start new varieties of businesses i believe the digital revolution will take over i think no more industrial revolution the technological revolution will uh, i think it's going to change forever so we don't know we have to keep we have to be mentally prepared we need to be mentally ready to handle this you know right now i'm seeing that my children are going through their art class over zoom music class over zoom dance classes you know everything is happening so it's going to be completely different i believe so yeah that's true and and what is manmohan saying manmohan is saying online many courses are available i'm i'm good in editing and trying to learn adobe photoshop fantastic manmohan you are you are learning new skills absolutely to avoid the uncertainty to handle yourself into the new world yes you need to learn new skills you know in the last one month alone i have i, I have started added more than 200 plus trainers in my community where they all want to learn how to train how to speak how to coach because that one skill everyone wants to learn now so similarly like you are learning an adobe photoshop awesome fantastic go ahead countries to close school and opt for home schooling shesh shadri yeah that's true i prefer that my favorite business my model also is home schooling better as as parents we can teach even my daughter i i do the home schooling here right now because thank you for continuously sharing your ideas that's that i connected to all my customers who oh my god disconnected when lockdown opens a lot of new opportunities are being absolutely that's the best thing because you are doing that you are able to connect with your customers because some someone asked me a few weeks um, days before how will i do business right now when there is whole lockdown but you know 67% of the business comes from our existing clients and all we need is just take care of our own uh, our own customers right now just talk to them be compassionate don't try to sell so thereby uh, we can actually help them better and uh, ankit karya what is that you are saying i think it's cleaning process absolutely i agree i agree with you it's a cleaning process nature is restoring itself and giving us an ample time to clean our heart body and mind wow absolutely true true i think ankit i really uh, appreciate your point and perspective right now nature knows how to heal itself huh? this is where i don't understand why people say that you know we are we are destroying nature we have to save we have to save the nature you know we are people saying all these things i think they are all it's an egoistic expression of a human being that they have to take care of the planet okay that itself is the bullshit stuff i believe the planet knows how to take care of itself even before you also the planet was there and after you also the planet will be there so it's just an egoistic expression of human beings so nature is taking care of itself and we have to just understand that nature is in right now in a little bit of cleaning mode and you have to just align yourself to that particular cleaning mode beautiful point ankit beautiful i really like that okay prem kumar says learners leaders are learners as i always say absolutely so this is the time we can actually uh, do a lot of learning and someone from bni is asking today how to increase bonding in chapter apart from one to one hey this is the time where you can do a lot of personalized one to one okay family one to one okay not just one to one family one to one okay do with the family okay sit with your family ask the other member to sit with their family chat with each other and build positive relationship with them don't talk i think other than business you can do a lot of other talks right now so that's another way i am seeing a lot of people are doing online tambola online musical online singing everything is happening so you can come up with some crazy ideas right now okay so thank you thank you and jay nayar after the first interaction with you as a trainer i am doing an introspection of my core area self enhancement by connecting to right people jay fantastic yes this is the time where we can actually connect with humanity connect with people through the digital well right now see accidentally it has opened up the facebook live uh, i was busy doing something else and by mistake i opened it but still every mistake is nothing but miss in the take first time i opened it abruptly and uh, the whole thing got ended up abruptly so just the reason i immediately opened up in a proper way and i'm communicating so this is the time where you can actually talk to people uh, you can go introspect your own self find out what's your core genius if you think you want to shift your profession uh, 
maybe that one particular passion or hobby i think this is the best time jay thank you very much jay for that brilliant point ha huh. now what is ganesh and thiru saying world itself being fast and one who can reflect during this time can emerge out like butterfly wow what an amazing analogy ganesh fantastic so right now it's more like a caterpillar transforming into a butterfly and when the caterpillar becomes a butterfly you know there is a small cocoon stage in between where it just passes and holds itself beautiful ganesh and that's an amazing analogy that you have shared that right now like a caterpillar we were busy doing our work and eating and sleeping and drinking and and you know complaining and bitching and <laughs> doing everything in the world and suddenly suddenly like uh, the caterpillar becomes a cocoon suddenly something emits out of its mouth and starts forming a saliva and the saliva surrounds it and forms a cocoon right now the whole planet is ensured that every human being stops doing various activity and gets into a cocoon stage okay now as you are in the cocoon you can do 101 things okay you can keep on cribbing why the hell am i inside this cocoon why is this happening why am i facing these challenges you can ask all the why 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 questions but all these why questions is not going to help you any which way so better you can always ask what can i do right now to get out of this situation or what is the best thing that i can do right now in this situation like many of you guys are suggesting self introspection talking to my customers learning new skills because once this period is over time is time for us to fly beautiful ganeshan fantastic point and sunil kumar ji what are you sharing rural business will grow it's my opinion and i'm planning that yes sunil absolutely a lot of new businesses is going to come vikash you are continuously sharing a lot of new points adversities actually are opportunities but it's up to use it okay either we can sleep and keep on watch movies and blame others or schedule the time uh we will get bored of sleeping but happy with new business opportunities says because yes this is the time i think you need to know how to work on all the areas of your life huh? your recreation area of your life your business area of your life your physical fitness of your life your contribution area of your life your know, spiritual area of your life you know all these days we never looked into all these areas we were only focused on only one area how to make money 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 and running from morning to night busy or busy and busyness has become our busyness itself so i think this is the time where uh, this challenge right now has given us a lot of opportunities in our mind in our self so that we can introspect and start thinking what to do in our life okay good point good point vikash fantastic passing through a tlc l1 great way to occupy time breaking the barrier and went live <laughs> yes dibyunta that's a good one you immediately implemented it thank you thank you very much thank you naval what are you saying naval learning internet marketing and how to become a world class trainer through your tlc university course thank you naval for sharing yes absolutely this is the time where we can learn a lot of new things and uh, that's the reason i am also teaching that in my tlc community and thank you very much for all the tlc guys uh, for coming and <laughs> joining this live and uh, it really uh, you know without thinking too much i just open the live and i'm just talking okay just out of my mind whatever comes i have no idea what am i going to tell you and there is no agenda so agenda less living okay so that, that that's my favorite topic huh? having a goalless life agenda less life effortless life and still achieve more in life according to my belief less is more do you believe that concept of less is more uh, less breathing gives you more life you know less things around you keeps your life comfortable and actually you can feel more in your life you know that's that's something which i really resonate with and uh, thank you very much and abhinav sakshena you're asking me this most interesting question wow which is this software which even pops up the you, you know everyone's comment on the screen yes sir no it's a software called be live.tv b e b live b e b live.tv it's a software which i use for my facebook live which which also engages with the audience also so that's the reason it's very good Shakti Vail, you are saying that emergent of new market for everyone in training industry. Absolutely, Shakti. This is going to be a rise of an information industry itself. Lot of info pruners are going to come out right now, okay? Uh, because a lot of people are trying to find alternate source of income now. So you have already committed a lot of mistakes in your life. You can actually share these mistakes. You have created a lot of mess in your life. You can share the message with others. probably this is the time where a lot of you will find lots and lots and lots and lots of teachers trainers masters information teacher pruners are going to come up right now so yes it's going to be an amazing time for the self education industry the whole education industry is going to go completely completely uh, change okay 
and shanti yes absolutely good to see you shanti of long time yes less is more thank you thank you for that beautiful comment abhinav saxena people have not just up just up here just we are not seeing that lockdown doesn't mean business down abhinav absolutely too lockdown doesn't mean business is down okay so it's a different way of looking at it it's an opportunity to do more business right now okay so but how you want to do it you need to learn how to do that okay uh, thank you vikash for <laughs> your uh, your comment each word of you are pearls of wisdom thank you very much vikash for that beautiful beautiful learning it's it's all about you know uh, time to declutter i think that's what ganeshan is also saying right now ganeshan you know is in a little decluttering philosophical mood i believe today because he said first from caterpillar to butterfly now he's talking about decluttering i think we have to do declutter of our mind first then the physical space and you know do you know that when you do the physical place decluttering or the mental space decluttering also has the same impact right so this is the time where we can clean up our desk clean up our shelf clean up our cupboard lot of cleaning up not only cleaning up these things even digital products that you are having you know that that when i was just checking out my hard disk i have lot of hard disk stored with me which i have not even touched for many years so declutter of that hard disk there are many apps in my laptop on my macbook on my desktop on my phone in my ipad which i am not even using for months okay so time to remove all those things so there are digital declutter mental declutter physical declutter you know thoughts declutter varieties of declutters we can do wow <laughs> thank you did you and that what are you saying we have to learn to think radical different thoughts and take new never before action to move forward oh yeah, absolutely we need to get out of our comfort zone and we are going to march into territories which is not explored so we are going to walk into uncharted territories and a lot of new business are going to open up which they don't even know whether this will work or not so be ready to get our outside the comfort zone that's what dibyunda tata is talking about so fantastic vivia what are you saying vivia a long time i'm catching up with you time to upgrade ourselves yes if you don't upgrade now you will degrade so better better we all upgrade ourselves that's this is the best time to upgrade ourselves thank you thank you for that beautiful suggestion if you don't upgrade you will always degrade so what is that you can upgrade what are the things that we can upgrade do you guys have any idea what are the things that you want to upgrade right now we upgrade your uh, life which part of your life would you like to upgrade go ahead and tell me okay and go ahead and comment below i will post that comment and uh, we can have a discussion on that so what is that nikki said hey please visit ranchi you are an inspiration wow fantastic yes nikki Once the lockdown is over, yes, we will. I will be there to Ranchi. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> no tree, no ocean, black screen. <laughs> yes, uh, Shadan. In the software, I can't change the black screen to any designs. So that's the reason I have a design outside. You see that? So that's the reason I have a design. So somewhere the design is complete. Like, you know, somehow I brought the design element to it so that at least the outer background has some design. So that's the reason. No. only in zoom you can do that but this is not a zoom live this is more like one interesting software i'm using and i'm just uh, showing to the world yes because givers are the happiest people so if you have some information in your life go ahead and open the facebook live and talk to people okay you don't have to be you don't have to have a specific content also without content in your head without having an agenda in your head you can actually do facebook live and that's what i'm actually doing right now I don't have any content. I don't have any idea what am I going to speak. I don't even know what I'm going to speak next. Depending upon what are the comments that is coming on the Facebook feed, I'm actually talking accordingly. That is another method of doing Facebook Live also. Vidya Madhavan Pillai, as a teacher in school, how can I uplift students for these days that they have lost? Okay. Hey, Vidya. First of all, they have not lost any days yet. They are uh, every day. I think every children is learning something new. It's only the teacher who thinks that. Oh my goodness, I'm missing this curriculum. I didn't teach them all these things. But I think every single day the student is continuously learning something new. They are continuously exploring the world with you or without you. They are always exploring. As a teacher, our only concern is, oh my goodness, these many days are gone. I have not imparted the lesson that I am supposed to impart. The academics are missing. If you're thinking like that, come innovatively, and this is where. i would always urge every school teacher through this video to become technologically adept okay because the students whom you are teaching they are high in technology so obviously you have to exhibit the technology leadership with your own students also whether you like it or not they are technologically born kids okay they are born in the technology world 
so better we also learn technology and start teaching them through technology there are multiple tools available there are there are technologically advanced teachers they have already gone online they can actually they can actually teach their subject online assignments online the whole classroom is built online so vidya come up with some another technological way because if this trend continues people will start looking out for options if, if we teachers do not learn how to engage our kids technologically we will lose the whole boat and then we will keep on creeping that we have not done anything and we say that you know what technology is changing people corrupting people we can use technology technology should not use us so as a teacher my suggestion to you is find out the technological portal through which still you can engage your children i am right now engaging with my community in multiple varieties of ways through mind maps through you know my ipad through my pencil through this particular medium and there are multiple multiple softwares that are available where you can go live you can draw you can write you can engage they can submit assignments go ahead and do that okay okay so i want to learn vikas yeah i want to learn dance photoshop try to focus on meditation hey dance itself is a meditation vikas go ahead and do that uh don't try to focus more on meditation because i don't think so you can do meditation meditation has to happen okay okay <laughs> shadan yes we will do one to one don't worry okay i will give you a separate time thank you very much for that feedback okay dibyun dibyun dadata this has for school management adapt and use zoom for online classes yes zoom is one particular software but there are lots and lots of other methodologies other ways to connect with your children it's possible i think uh, many schools will come up with it they don't have unfortunately many school teachers are not technologically comfortable now only they have reached hangout so they are using hangouts and skype so far they will come to zoom okay forcefully they are all now force fitted into the technological world so obviously they will come and if this lockdown continues just imagine huh? unfortunately if the lockdown continues what they will do okay fortunately we are now getting into the summer holiday season it's okay but how are you going to manage the parents are going to have tough time If you are a parent of kids, how are you going to manage this lockdown? You are also sitting in the home. Parents also going to be there. So how are you going to manage this whole holiday period? Huh? You you know you need to enjoy the holiday also at the same time. You also need to make money. Wow, Arun Kumar J Raman, it's time to learn some new foreign language. Yes, absolutely true. Why don't you learn some interesting language right now? What do you think is the best language that we can learn? Go ahead and comment. Okay, and also please let me know which is your favorite language and why you want to learn. I'm I'm. I want to learn Korean for a long time. I I learned Chinese little bit here and there. Then after that, I lost touch with that. But I have to recoup that. And uh, Korean is a beautiful language because I watch a lot of Korean movies in my life, and I love the language. Probably that's one language I'm thinking to learn. Okay, that's a good point, Arun, for stimulating my thoughts. Thank you for that. Thank you, uh, thank you, Vidya, for sharing that comment. Thank you very much. Upgrade skills, Vidya, Vivya. You say that upgrade skills because when we know better, we do better. Whoa, yes. Okay, I think I will I will reverse your statement, Vidya, uh, Vivya. Sorry, upgrade skills because when we do better, we know better. Okay, it's not we know better, we do better. The actually the opposite side. This is what I personally practice and believe. First, doing that means you do it, then you will know it instead of knowing and doing. Because according to me, doing is only knowing. So a little bit of twist in your whole statement. Okay, is that okay with you? Okay. Uh, Dibyan, thank you for continuously engaging in this Facebook live. We can analyze which business can deliver even during lockdown and get new business ideas. Oh yes, there are multiple varieties of businesses which can actually go live. Uh, right now, some of my friends who are all good friends, BNM members, they've come up with some hand sanitizer business suddenly. Okay, and suddenly in the last two weeks, uh, they sold cans and cans and bottles and bottles of hand sanitizers. Okay, and that's working very well. Suddenly, a new business called hand sanitizers. all these days people were nowhere worried about hand washing at all now everyone is washing hands now okay so that suddenly it became a business opportunity online delivery of your product and services if you can do that probably that will be very good online system anything which you can create and deliver online digital asset okay and digital asset management will become an another new business we don't know varieties of business will come arun jayram and you want to learn japanese awesome very good fantastic very good Oh yeah, why you say because you know some basic Japanese and you want to learn some Japanese now in this time. Awesome, it's a very good, very good language. Go ahead. The most peaceful, you know, they they brought in peace in chaos. You know, when when the world war happened, when the whole nuclear bomb, you know, busted the whole city of Tokyo and Hiroshima and Nagasaki. You know, those are the people. It's an amazing culture, Japanese culture. They actually converted the chaos into peace. It's a beautiful, and that's how they transformed themselves, com themselves completely, right? So. 
I think it all depends upon how we look into the chaos and how to what perspective we look into it and thereby uh, we can transform ourselves. So Japanese, I love Japanese. Go ahead and learn that and uh, if possible, share it with others also. Okay, so right now, uh, guys, I have zero idea. Uh, just like that randomly, I opened up this uh, camera and I just started speaking on Facebook Live. And uh, just sharing my thoughts, uh, suddenly I got bored in between. I don't know what to do. So suddenly I said, okay, let me, if I get bored, I immediately start talking to people, right? It's the easiest way. Share whatever you have from your mind, whatever comes out of your mind, because uh, it's not thinking. It just flows through you, right? So that's how I always live life right now. So just going with the flow of life. I think going with flow of life is one of the best way to live life. You know? No, you know, like, like the wooden log floating on the water. It is flowing on the water river, the wood. It is touching the water, but it is not completely submerged. I think that is one quality that we all have to learn. Live like a wooden log. Float like a wooden log. Still, don't stay, not, not like a wooden log on a stagnated water, on a flowing water. <laughs> we are ready. What are you saying? As you said, deliver online. I think we can concentrate on creating blogs, a website which can create more customers. Absolutely, Vivian. Blog writing, content writing, sharing your knowledge. This is going to become a huge demand right now. So if you have amazing skill of writing or analyzing, creating content, this is the best time to even start that particular business. Okay, good. Sunil Shah, want to learn business knowledge from you? Yes, come to BNI. We will teach you that. And I'm always happy to teach whatever I know. Okay. Business is very simple, Sunil. You find a problem in the world and you start solving the problem. You solve a small problem, you make small money, you solve a big problem. You make big money. That's all in one line business is all about. Okay? But the purpose of business is to create happy customers. That's the purpose of business. Uh, how do you know the customers are happy? When they are satisfied. How do you know that they are satisfied? When they give you references. Okay, That's all. So side effect is money making. So right now, just go analyze what are the various problems customers are facing, the whole world is facing. And if with your skill or passion, if you can come up with a solution, ta-da, you got a million dollar jackpot idea. Go ahead and jump and do it. And this is what I have understood, Sunil. Any business you start, you're going to fail. Okay, so plan to lose. Planning to lose is one good quality of great leaders. And plan to lose. You may fail. You will fail. Do not worry, but fail faster. And start tweaking it. And once you fail, stand up, run, and go to the next project. That's the only way we can achieve success in life. Thank you. You are answer Google, even don't. <laughs> Thank you, Vikash. Shanmugo Sundar says, start writing a book and keep everything ready to get published later. Hey, absolutely true. This is the time. You know, I have been asking this question. How many of you want to write a book? Okay. If I ask 10 people, 8 of them will say, me, 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 me. Everyone wants to write a book. But will they write? No. Not even one person is ready to write a book because they don't know how to write a book. Okay. In my TLC, in my trainer's university, we actually have a course. We teach how to write a book. After learning also, many people don't write. Why? Because only a few people take action. Book writing is the most easiest thing. It takes only 100 days to write a book call. That's it. I have my, my, you know, my friend Sudhir Kollam writes a book in 48 hours nowadays. You know, that's the speed in which he goes to Starbucks cafe, sits and writes the book. And that's how he launched his second book also. Book writing. This is the time where you can actually sit and reflect and write a book. And remember, when you write a book, ask yourself with the end in the mind. Why am I writing this book? For whom am I writing this book? And you don't have to write the book to sell. Okay, Write a book to give to people. Because that's another way of helping people also. Because it's your unique thoughts. Publish the book. You can do self-publishing. Uh, because I think from I think five years or six years from now, you will not find any publishers in the market, I believe. It's no more book. Huh? Physical books are slowly, slowly vanishing. And slowly everyone wants to read the electronic book. Though many people don't like the electronic book. But... You don't have an option. Okay, right now I'm, my Kindle is filled with electronic books only right now. But that's the next generation is reading and consuming everything electronically. So probably this generation itself, the whole book itself, the concept of physical books will vanish, I believe. But the joy of reading a physical book, you can't match that with electronic book. But you can always publish it now, Shanmugo Sundaram, on your own for free. Even go to Amazon Kindle, you can do it for free. You can actually do it. Okay, so you can do that. Oh, wow, Sunil. You are a member of BNI Passion Surat. Awesome. Welcome to this particular Facebook Live. Thank you for joining. Vikash, what are you saying, Vikash? I focus only on giving. Get written more than expected. Absolutely. Just keep on giving. Huh? I, I, I always say become a shameless giver. Okay. Just keep on giving. You don't know how universe will respond back and give back to you in multi-folds. Okay. 
just go on give people i think giving is the next way of next way of living itself okay go ahead and give every time i hear i get motivated how is this possible any art to learn through some light <laughs> I think whatever I am sharing with you is what I am doing right now in my life, Shadik. And that's the reason, uh, you know, when you say that, uh, why do you get motivation? Remember, from where does motivation come from? There are certain patches, there are certain gaps, certain lack of understanding, and suddenly that light bulb suddenly glows. You know, wow, oh, I never thought that perspective. That's all. So all you need to learn is, Siddiq, is connecting perspectives, okay? How can you connect anything to anything? That's an art which you can continuously learn. And continuously, you have to observe it. Only with observation, this particular art is going to come. And everyone can do that. Uh, and if you start sharing that with everyone, you will become better and better and better. That's all. So just go ahead and start doing it. I have done a lot of mistakes, and that's the reason uh, it, it just comes. Huh? And, the, and the easiest way is just go with your flow of your life. Just believe and trust. The flow will come through you, and you will answer it. You will always answer it. Ah, Vivia, what are you saying? Uh, please suggest me how to create a habit, like reading a book or exercising or whatever we like to do. How to convert it into a passion. Hey, habit. Okay, now it's not habit. It's all about micro actions. Say, for example, you want to read a book. This is how I actually develop reading a book. Okay, Today, I read 200 pages a day because of that one action I took. Okay, Whatever I do is whenever I bought a book, no, I will not read. Huh? I will carry the book the whole day in my hand. Wherever I go, to clients, to customers, to company, to office, wherever I go, the book will be there in my hand. Now, even if I just stand up and walk and go somewhere also, I will always carry the book with me. What happens since I am carrying my mind, you know, the monkey inside you, now starts thinking, why the hell this fellow is carrying the book? Okay, why is he not opening and reading? Your mind has to tell you that. Once the mind gives you that command, now you will open up and start reading. See the reading, the reading habit. Why people are not able to catch up is because the mind plays monk, you know, plays tricks with us. Once you read one page, you will end up in uh, sleeping, and that's the reason you keep it away. So easier way is trick the mind. Huh? Carry this. So it's not the reading of the book habit. It is what are the precursors to that habit. Okay, the rituals that you that will build up to that habit is very very important. Even the same as exercising. What is that 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 small micro push micro thing that you will do? which will start you to do that probably that laying down the yoga mat on the floor okay that's all do that every day one day you will get into the exercising habit so it's a small micro atomic habits there's a book called atomic habit by james clear read that book you will find a lot of small small micro tips which will help you vikash can you edit my book hey i am not an editor vikash but you can edit it on your own and but there are a lot of good editors out there you can also do it because i'm not a professional professional editor that that's not my core genius okay how did this free flowing expression evolve please update us sir i have no idea uh, i think that comes only when you start living life on the flow only when you just believe the flow of life okay everything flows through you because i think the inside you the inherent intelligence inside you is always connected to the external the whole universal intelligence. That means the consciousness inside you is always connected to the consciousness outside. That means both are same. And uh, all you need is uh, always have this connection live. Okay, uh, Like this Facebook connection live going on. So if you can keep that live, I think it happens. The only destroyer of this connection is our ego. So number one, you have to drop your ego and just accept everything as they are so when you drop the ego and accept everything as they are the connection between you and the higher level uh, existence the consciousness always is connected so the energy flows through you and you speak i think that's that's what the answer i got right now as you asked me this question okay this is the first time i'm answering this question also i have no idea i hope that answer your question dibyunda Okay, my mind prefers video rather than going for reading. What should I do? Hey, Sunil, if you like watching videos, go ahead and learn videos, right? There are a lot of videos are there. Go to TEDx, watch a lot of videos. You know, recently I've started watching a lot of interesting documentaries, you know, through an app called Curiosity Streaming. Curiosity Stream, I just downloaded it. Amazing documentaries. It's a learning documentary where I can learn about history, nature, animals, technology, science, everything. So if you love videos, go ahead. And consume videos it's not mandatory that you have to read okay some 
some will consume electronically video some has to read some has to hear everyone's uh, capacities are different so go ahead and do that shiva what do you say you advise us read 200 pages per day and you had advice us just to read without putting it in mind does it apply to all genres uh, shiva yes it applies to all genres just go ahead and read allow the mind to comprehend it you don't comprehend it yes okay best movie to read best book to read oh, there are multiple books are there again uh, it all depends upon uh, what book to read okay again to, with respect to that particular time and your mood everything I don't know in which level you are in right now. Uh, there are some of the best books. Focus on one. One thing is a very good book which you can read right now. The author is called Gary Keller, which helps you to think on only one angle. Okay. And best movie. Oh, there are many, many movies. Other I don't know which one to recommend. But I always like one movie called Shashank Redemption. Okay. Always my all-time favorite movie, Shashank Redemption. Little old classic, class movie. Yeah. That with all available resources, still you can achieve a lot of things. Huh? Watch that movie. At the last 15 minutes, it will just blow your mind. Shashank Redemption is a favorite movie of mine. Another movie which I always loved watching is Casual uh, Suspects. It's another English movie. Beautiful movie. Uh, there are a lot of movies in various languages. Okay? Various languages, different, different movies are there. Recently, one of the best Oscar winning movie in a Korean movie called Parasite. Beautiful production. Very good movie. I keep watching a lot of movies, one movie a day. How to overcome bad habits. First of all, accept that it is a bad habit for you. Once you accept it, you will overcome it. Many people do not accept that they have a bad habit. That's the reason they are struggling to overcome. Okay, so just over, it's very easy. You need to become aware of it and you need to create some, uh, you know, stacking up of good habits to that. For example, you want to get rid of smoking, for example, you need to find another way. You know, another habit you need to over, you need to create, for example, I don't chew a chocolate, okay, whenever I get that feeling. Okay? And you need to find out which is the trigger for that bad habit. Every bad habit starts with a trigger. Maybe it may be a thought, it may be a feeling, it may be something you should see, or even one of your friend or some, some something is connected, okay, find the cue or the trigger and cut it over there and build up with another trigger, another positive trigger. That's how you overcome a bad habit. Hmm, what else? Okay, who says? Okay, Siddiq, there is a step of becoming a brand coach. How do we start from scratch and what are the things we have to learn? Whether personal development, communication skills, body language traits, which coach to follow? Hey, brand coach is all about branding. How do you help others to become a brand? Okay, so it involves holistic development of every angle. For that, you need to become a brand first to become a brand coach. So, step one, focus on yourself and change yourself. When you change yourself, the whole bill will start following you and you also become a brand and so that people will follow. And who says, Ankur Mehta says, yes, Cheshank Redemption is an awesome movie. Yes, absolutely. It's a beautiful movie. I understand from you, what is the Dibyond Datta says, Dib what you, I understand from you that we have to find our own channels to express ourselves and it will also flow here into our channel. Absolutely. Yes, 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 absolutely. Thank you, Vikash, for that. Thank you, Vikash, for that beautiful comment talking to you. I feel we should never stop learning. This is what I have understood. The more I learn, I, I think I come to a conclusion. Actually, I understand very less in the world. The more and more I understand, more and more I learn, I think I understand that I actually know very small, very less only I actually know. That's the reason learning opens up for you to open up in another dimension of, you know, uh, ignorance is bliss. Huh? Another angle of uh, fighting your own, uh, fighting your own argument is ignorance is bliss. Better you don't learn. Okay. Be ignorant because that is better. But once you learn something, no, once it comes into your understanding, the understanding becomes heavy. If you don't take action, the understanding becomes heavy. So learn a lot, Vikash, learn a lot of Vikash. But uh, once you learn, put it in practice and make it into a wisdom because knowledge becomes heavy weight. Okay? Knowledge becomes weight. So don't allow the knowledge to become heavy weight inside you. Okay. So it looks like for the last 40 minutes I'm talking uh, without even having an agenda, without having a topic. As you guys are putting some comment and I'm just talking from that. Okay, wow, fantastic. And let's conclude today's Facebook Live. Okay, Vaining says, learning is a process, I feel. Yeah, absolutely. Learning is a continuous process. All of us have to learn continuously. Learning ourselves is the number one job. Okay, understanding why am I doing what am I doing is something very, very important. 
and our number one learning should be what is the purpose of me born okay what is the purpose of my life and uh, live that purpose that's all so if you someone asks me what is the purpose of life i think purpose of life is to live life only that's all it's not to change anyone else in the world first you have to learn to understand what's your purpose and live that purpose thank you navel 10x by grand cardone is an awesome book fantastic fantastic absolutely will help you okay stay hungry stay foolish that's an amazing book thank you guys thank you so with this let's conclude our uh, facebook uh, live today okay guys if you guys have really enjoyed this go ahead and share this on your timeline or just share this link on whatsapp so that someone will get someone who's getting bored right now just by watching this random video they will also get benefited because we discussed on multiple topics of life itself overall in every aspect of life we just discussed and nothing is planned everything is an ad hoc uh, topic and just go ahead and uh, if you have any friends of yours who really really uh, want to learn more uh, go ahead and uh, you know uh, ask them to you know uh, register for my happiness uh, i don't know how many of you are part of my happiness course where i actually talk every single day so if you guys know someone just ask them to sign up for this happiness program which is daily one daily thought i just keep sending so it's free if you know someone or if you have not already part of it just register in this website every single day i'll send you one happiness thought from my perspective and if you think that this uh, facebook live has helped you go ahead and share okay so thank you very much for being here in this session thank you guys and for putting your time and energy with me for the last one hour or no 40 minutes or so, so so i hope it was useful to you thank you very much and have a pleasant pleasant evening but remember uh, stay indoor stay safe be responsible don't try to do some heroism this is the time just stay indoor just stay with your family spend time okay so thank you very much guys tada bye bye see you and this is motil sundram your happiness coach signing off bye bye